Scientists believe that over 4 billion years ago, Mars was a living planet, but then something happened that caused the wipeout of all the forms of life from Mars. Finally, my wait is over. I heard the news that UAE's space robot is arriving to my planet Mars. Oh boy, I am so excited. Hi. Hi, I'm Hussein. Thank you for having me here in your space lab. Welcome, Hussein. It's our pleasure. What would you like to know? I would love to know about UAE's Mars mission. Okay, so let's see. So let's get started. Six years ago, a team of UAE scientists and astronauts joined together to start preparing Emirates' mission to Mars. Hope Probe, or Al Amal, as it is called in Arabic, is a robot built by by the team of from Mohammed bin Rashid Space Center with experts from Colorado and California. This robot is planned to launch into space on 20th July 2020 from Tanegashima Space Center in Japan and is expected to reach Mars in February 2021. Now I'll hand it over to my engineer who will explain to you about the rocket. Yay, I'm really excited! Hi Hussein, are you ready for the demo? Yes, I can't wait! Okay, so the robot is made up of aluminium metal in honeycomb structure with large solar plates attached to its sides, an antenna on its top and various cameras. Wow, that looks cool! I wonder what these large plates would do. Let's try to guess. Oh, I know, are they used for generating power? Excellent! That's right. These solar plates will use the energy from the sun to produce up to 1800 watts of power. Wow, that's super powerful. Now can you tell me why this antenna is here? Mm, is it used for some signals? Awesome. It is used for communicating with the space center. And what are these cameras for? These cameras will help us take clear photos of the planet Mars so that we can understand the atmosphere of Mars in a better way. This guy seems to be pretty heavy. Oh yes, it weighs around 1,350 kilos. Wow, that's heavy. It must be slow also then. Haha, ha. oh no. That's the cool part. It's super fast too. It has a speed of 121,000 kilometers per hour, which means it can cover 493 million kilometers in just seven months. That's really cool. Now, let's get you back to the lab. Hey, Hussein, how are you feeling? I'm pretty amazed. It's really awesome. But I have one more question. Yeah, sure, go ahead. After reaching Mars, for how long the robot stays there? We have arranged for the robot to stay at Mars for 657 days, which is equal to one Martian year. But, oh wait, one Martian year? But I thought 657 days means almost two years. Great thinking. A length of a day on a planet is measured by time. It takes for that planet to rotate around its orbit, Earth. Being near to the sun has a shorter orbit and it takes almost 24 hours for it to rotate, whereas Mars being farther from the sun requires almost double that time to complete its rotation, so that means two days on Earth equals one day at Mars. Thank you so much, I understood very well, I'm glad. I'm really excited to become a scientist. All right. <sighs> Hi, alien. This is Hussein coming from the planet Earth. Welcome, Hussein. My name is Ortex. I have been waiting for the humans for the last four billion years. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel and be ready for our next adventure from Mission Mars. Goodbye.